Well, when you hit the gym, you probably stick to the same workout. Right, and some like cardio, others like weightlifting. Mm -hmm. But one of those workouts apparently benefits your heart more. And it might not be what you think. Greg Argos <laughs> is here now to explain. And Yuki, you may think running a marathon or taking a power walk is one of the healthiest options for staying in shape. And though experts say both are great for your health, new research shows resistance training, working out by lifting weights, for example, could be even more beneficial. Hitting the weights or pounding the pavement. Everybody has a different preference on how they like to stay in shape. Push up, sit ups, and running. I walk a lot and I walk really fast. I lift weights. And I play some rugby as well. I work with uh, three year olds. <laughs> but which is better? New research released earlier this month by the American College of Cardiology found strength training may be more effective than cardiovascular exercise at reducing the risk of heart disease. Actually better for you. Wow. Essentially that Olympic power clean could be even healthier than that 5K run. I feel more exhausted after a run as opposed to She's lifting. She's never <laughs> ran two or three miles. <laughs> two clean and jerks. Any exercise and all exercise is good. But George Karoulis, a personal trainer and owner of CrossFit 2 Street in Pennsport, told me what sets resistance training apart is what happens after the workout is done. The any type of resistance training is going to allow you to burn more calories post-workout. So you're actually working when you're done the exercise routine, yeah. uh, burning calories at night. That's because your metabolism is in overdrive, rebuilding muscle that were used during the workout. People deadlift, I'm just like, mm -mm, not for me. And you don't have to be an extreme bodybuilder or Olympic lifter. Rula says even using your own body weight is beneficial. We can do air squats, we can do push-ups, we can do things like that, burpees. Uh, you know, that's still resistance training because you're fighting against gravity necessarily and plus your body weight. The study also found strength training led to a 30 to 70% lower rate of cardiovascular disease regardless of gender or age. Resistance training is going to fight osteoporosis. Uh, it's going to help keep your muscle tone and muscle mass that you need as you get older. So next time you're waiting at the gym for an open treadmill, maybe walk on over to the free weights and give your health the lift. Now, if you're interested in doing more resistance training, Carilla says play it safe. Make sure you're following a structured workout and don't try an Olympic deadlift right away. He says it could be better to start with some body resistance exercises like burpees or pull-ups. Don't start lift putting you know 200 pounds yeah. on the rack. Right. And no, 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 no. <laughs> I use the you, you can do 250. What is this to 250. The remote? <laughs> yeah, right. No, I do use the resistance bands though. Yeah, that's yeah. just as good. Nice and light. There you go. Right. I was going to say, what about the, the remote? The remote. The remote. That that's weighs a good something, one. right? <laughs> that's a good one. Half a pound. <laughs> yeah, that's good. Thank you, bud. Sure.